Oh my, oh me, what's that? Can it be? It started as a wiggle and grew into a shake. And now I'm on the floor, I'm squirming like a snake. Ooh, ants in your pants. Ooh, ooh, ants in your pants. You giggle, you wiggle, you jiggle, you dance. Mmm, you got ants in your pants. Everybody. Hey, and welcome to Ants in Your Pants. I'm your host, the funkiest monkey that you'll ever see, Lickety Split. And guess what? I got a special surprise today, because oh, look what I found. Look at that. It's a little toy chainsaw. I mean, a real chainsaw would be kind of dangerous, but it's a little toy plastic one. It's great. I love it. You know how I got it? What happened was, around lunchtime, I was going home, and I found in this pile of leaves and sawdust this little toy chainsaw. And nobody was around, so, well, I just kind of figured I could take it home. I mean, that's okay, isn't it? And it's really, really fun! <laughs> that's kind of fun. I always wanted one just like this. And there it was, just waiting for me. It must have been fate! Yeah! I love playing with my chainsaw. It's neat to kind of have, you know, little tools and things that you can pretend that you're other people doing stuff. Like, um, oh, let's say you could have uh, one of those big machines that digs up dirt when they're putting up a new building and stuff like that. Oh, boy. I'm so excited. I want to dance. Do you guys want to dance with me? Yeah, because we got some great videos coming up. Oh, we do. Some great music to have your toes snapping and your fingers clapping and all that kind of stuff. Okay, so are you ready? We're gonna have one right now. It's called Ugga Bug by Douglas John. Oh boy, he's got a bug problem. There's an Ugga Bug on my window. There's an Ugga Bug on the floor. There's a hundred ugga bugs marching in and out of my big front door. There's a creepy crawly on my ceiling. There's a creepy crawly on the wall. There are a hundred creepy crawlies marching up and down in my big front hall. Quick, let's close the window. Quick, let's sweep the floor. Quick, let's put a screen across my big front door. Quick, let's close the window. Quick, let's sweep the floor. Quick, let's put a screen across my big front door. There's an ugga bug. An ugga bug. Mm, ugga bug. Mm, an ugga bug. There's a widget wit on the window. There's a widget wit on the floor. There's a hundred widget wits marching in and out of my big front door. There's a hula hoo on the wall. There's a hundred hula hoos marching up and down in my big front hall. Quick, let's close the window. Quick, let's sweep the floor. Quick, let's put a screen across the big front door. Quick, let's close the window. Quick, let's sweep the floor. Quick, let's put a screen across the big front door. When it's late at night and you're trying to get to sleep And suddenly you hear a tiny little creak And your mind starts painting pictures in your head And pretty soon you wonder just what's under your bed Oh, it might be a gator or a big black snake From a bottomless pit of an old earthquake Or some slimy creature coming up from the deep Sometimes it's hard for you to get to sleep Now during the day you like to sit and play Your room's a little messy but you like it that way Still you don't play too near the edge Cause you just don't know what's under your bed and it might be a gator or a big black snake From a bottomless pit of an old earthquake Or some slimy creature coming up from below Who grab your foot and never let go 
When it's late at night and you hear a little sound, it's nice to know that your mom's around. You call for her, you say, I thought I was dead, cause there's some sort of creature hiding under my bed. And it might be a gator or a big crocodile With long white teeth and a hungry smile Or the Loch Ness Monster coming up from below Whatever it was, it was licking my toe Now moms are great, they're hard to scare She's not afraid to look under there She gets her flashlight and she shakes her head As she pulls those creatures out from under my bed Two mismatched socks, a pair of underwear My new softball and my old teddy bear Thirteen pennies and a few cracker crumbs And a little candy heart that says let's have fun Well, the story's been told, it's all been said There are no real creatures hiding under your bed Just a few of your things, maybe some money And a few little friends that we call dust bunnies but there are no alligators, no big black snakes to bother you or keep you awake. So the next time you hear a tiny little creak, just close your eyes and go back to sleep. Close your eyes and go back to sleep. Close your eyes and go back to sleep. You go on back to bed now, darling. Hi again! Woo! Weren't those some great videos? And all that time I was having so much fun and playing with my brand new toy. It's a toy chainsaw! Because a real chainsaw, you know, that wouldn't be so much fun. But this one's so much fun because, well, well, I mean, it's not really mine, but it's still a lot of fun. I mean, well, there's no name on it or anything. And you know, it's really helpful that when you own something, you should put your name on it. Because that way, people will know whose it is, and if they find it, well, they can return it to you. Oh, I love this chainsaw, though. It's so amazing. I don't know. Who owns it, though? Is it yours? No? No, I guess it wouldn't be. Hmm. <laughs> I wonder what I should do. Hmm. I don't know. I need to do something with it. Come on. Look at chainsaw crying. I wonder why she said. I wish that she was smiling and not feeling bad. <laughs> I've been I know the, what I'm going to do. I'll keep this amazing chainsaw until I find out who it belongs to, you know? But, I mean, I do have sort of an idea who it might belong to, but, nah. Well, it was just lying there. Finders, keepers, losers, weepers, right? Oh, this is so cool. Hey, do you want to watch another video? You do? Oh, me too. There's a truck in my toe. There's a truck in my toe. There's a truck in my toe. It's a tow truck. <laughs> One, two, three, say, oh dear, let's get out of here. Trucks over here, trucks over there. Trucks in my backyard, trucks are everywhere. Trucks in my sandbox, trucks in the street. I can't sit down.
the water spout Down came the rain and washed the spider out Out came the sun and dried up all the rain So the inky dinky spider went up the spout again Was climbing up a tree Poor Inky Dinky Spider fell down And scraped his knee When his knee felt Better To his home he sped And his mom washed his Little knee and Kissed him on the head Inky Dinky Spider Loved to play outside Always running here and there with little brother by his side. When the fun is over, he knows just what to do. He comes inside and washes up and has a little snooze. Inky Dinky Spider, a tired little guy. Will not go to sleep and do you know why? He wants his hugs and kisses and a story too. So Inky Dinky Spider is really just like you. Inky Dinky Spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and Wash the spider out Out came the sun and, and dried up all the rain So the inky dinky spider Went up the spout again Up the spout again Up the spout again This is a great toy chainsaw. That was pretty cool, huh? Huh? Did you think so? Yeah, I can cut anything with my toy chainsaw. Even this stick here. Uh-oh. Well, what am I going to cut now? I got a toy chainsaw, and, um, well, it's made for cutting down trees, but well, I don't want to cut down my beautiful tree. It's too nice. And so I've been looking for things that I can chop up, but I can't find anything. <sighs> I love my chainsaw, though. Maybe what I could do is I could be a carpenter, kind of like those ants. And, oh, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking that this chainsaw is really Jane saws, huh? Well, maybe it is. But, well, you know what they say, finders, keepers, losers, weepers, and those ants have been so nasty to me sometimes. So, dan nan a boo boo Heh, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's my chainsaw now, even though maybe it wasn't before. Jane saw lost it, and, and she didn't have a name on it either. Yeah. Okay, listen here, Rance. Mm. Yeah, look at that. I got a chainsaw. I got chainsaw's chainsaw. Did you hear that, Ant? <laughs> All right, I got a new toy, and maybe I can really bug those ants. <laughs> okay, this is going to be called Funky Teapot by Judy and David, a cool video. Stand up if you know the teapot song and sing it with us. I'm a funky teapot, short and stout. Here is my handle, here is my spout. When I get all steamed up, hear me shout. Just tip me over and pour me out. Woo! Oh, that sounds so good. Let's hear you try it now. I'm a funky teapot. <laughs> with us. Come on, have a cup of room, Ray. Have a 
chamomile, an orange pea, go and sit for a while. Slice of lemon, orange rind, spoon of sugar, drop a honey, we'll do fine. Early in the morning, late at night, out in the opener, out of sight, in a big brown mug, a little pink cup. When you reach the bottom, I'll fill it up. I'm a funky teapot. Sandy, do you know how to monkey talk? Monkey talk? Do you want to learn? Okay. Okay, it's easy. I'll show you. Yabba day. Yabba day. Yabba dee. Yabba dee. Yabba die. Yabba die. Yabba do. Yabba do. Yabba do. Yabba do. Now you. Now I can. can monkey, monkey talk. talk. I can monkey, monkey talk. talk. Yabba day. I don't know. Do you? Yabba-dee. 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 yabba do yabba do yabba Now you. Now you can. Get monkey talk. Monkey talk. yabba do Sometimes why? Why? I don't know. Do you? Yabba day. Yabba day. Yabba day. Yabba day. Yabba day. Now you. Now we can. Get monkey talk. Monkey talk. hear something? I, I thought I heard something. It it kind of sounded like crying. Yeah. Um, did you hear somebody crying? Uh, it sounded almost like an ant crying. Hmm. Maybe this is Janesaw's chainsaw. And maybe she's crying because she can't find her favorite toy. I mean, if I lost my favorite toy, I'd be crying too. Especially if someone I knew had it and wouldn't give it back. Hmm. Well... I guess that's not very nice, is it? <sighs> oh, well. It's such a cool toy. I was really hoping that I'd be able to keep it, but it's not the right thing to do. I mean, it belongs to somebody else. I guess I gotta go back to that pile of leaves and leave it there, and then Janesaw can have her chainsaw back. <sighs> In the meantime, let's watch a video. This is a hand clap band by Terry and Rick. Hmm. Let's try to wake up the people next door. Slow. 
once more with your hands. That's how to be a member of the hand clap band. Where you look, the whole world around. Different kind of kids make different kind of sounds. Some use their hands, some use their feet to make a little rhythm, to make a little beat. Street beat, street beat. Everybody knows a street beat. Street beat, street beat. Everybody knows a street beat. Down in Cape Town, kids have fun. The tin can kids, they're number one. They have a little game you shouldn't miss. With two tin cans, they go like this. Everybody does it, it comes alive. So come on, join in, do the hand job. They say a beat that's bound to come this way. Slap your hands on your knees and shoe. I'll show the shoe blah blah to you. Here's a game that two can play. Face your partner, hold your hands this way. Takes a little practice, takes a little time to keep the beat. You can say this rhyme, Miss Me from Alabama. Sitting on a rocker, eating chocolate blocker, watching the clock go tick tock. Walla walla tick tock. Here's a sound, it's out of sight. The strangest thing, it's dynamite. Your face is a drum, so to speak, because you take your hands and you tap your cheek. And back we go, Miss Mew from Alabama, sitting on a rocker, eating chocolate blocker, watching the clock go tick tock, tick tock, to walla walla tick tock, shoe pop. Everybody knows a street beat, street beat, street beat. Everybody knows a street beat. Well, by now you know what I'm talking about. Street beats are hot, and there's no doubt. A catchy rhythm, a catchy sound will travel the whole wide world around. Street beat, street beat. Everybody knows a street beat, street beat, street beat. Everybody knows a street beat. Boy, I'm really going to miss my... I mean, THE chainsaw. It was the coolest, most amazing chainsaw I'd ever seen. But it wasn't mine. It was not meant to be. <sighs> oh, well, I know that if I lost something of mine, especially if it was my favorite, I'd want someone to return it if they found it.
Well, it sounds... Yeah! It sounds like Chainsaw found a chainsaw. Well, that makes me feel pretty good inside. It makes me want to get my favorite toy out. Look at this. I saw something. Look at this! It's my favorite toy in the world! It's it's my little fishy! It's my fish Danny! I hope you guys had a good time today, and I'll see you soon! Bye Danny! Bye!